Hello, uh, today I woke up and I was like, I'm gonna attempt to do my makeup, which I did. And I'm very happy I did. <laughs> I'm very impressed. Like, it was looking good until I added this pink over here. I like, kind of just ruined it. But yeah, so now I'm gonna take it off because I want to shower. And <laughs> yeah, that's literally all. I'm so happy with myself, given the fact that I haven't touched a makeup brush in like one year. That's quite something. So I'm gonna keep practicing and work on my blending and my eyebrows. So. Good morning, beautiful people. Oh, it's another beautiful day to have a beautiful day and a beautiful week to have a beautiful week. Just realized I didn't say that yesterday when I was doing my couple that when yesterday I don't remember. Anyways, I am so hungry and it is currently 7:20 a.m. Yesterday I didn't eat anything for the whole day and then in the evening at around 6 or 7 I had coffee and a hot dog naturally i'll be hungry so um i want to have a mango right now because if i do have solid food now it's going to disturb me the rest of the day yesterday i slept very early that's why i was up at like five yeah i've just been in bed anyways my day starts at 8 a.m so i haven't done anything planned for the day until 8 a.m i'm gonna i'm just gonna wait for 8 a.m so welcome back to this week's vlog and thank you thank you so much for all the love and support you've been showing to my vlogs oh my goodness now can we get this book to 30 likes yes 30 that's a stretch <laughs> just finished my bible study it is currently 8 35 a.m today's bible study was really really interesting we were learning we learned i learned <laughs> about um this the parables of the sower you see um the four types of seeds that were sown so go read that at your own time it is in matthew chapter 13 verses 1 to 23 so yeah right now i want to make my bed and then i'm gonna get ready for the day and we can start our day Okay, we have already started. We can continue with our day. Hello, it's currently 8.47 and I'm ready to go downstairs. My bag, it has my laptop and everything I'm going to need while I'm down there because I really don't want to come up back again until I really, really have to. So, yeah. Trying to set up my camera. You got a bounce from two seconds ago. Said you just got in the house. It's hard to believe that you are at home by yourself. When I just heard the voice, heard the voice of someone else. Just this question, why do you feel you gotta lie? Getting caught up in your cave. But well, you cannot say my name. I know I say that I'm so with things. Someone's going down as the way it seems. Shouldn't be no reason why you act astray. If nobody's holding it for me, I know how you should do. We're saying everything to me, don't you? Why can't you just tell the truth? If somebody's there, then tell me. so it is currently 4 25 and boy the afternoon has been quite interesting a lot has happened i am not done with everything i wanted to do today but that's okay and i think i'm gonna stop there i'm gonna pick that up tomorrow
Okay, so today is one of those days where I really don't feel well at all. Today's feeling is really weird, to be honest. A bit worse than yesterday, but we're gonna push through. I, I feel like I'm so tired of being in this house. I'm so tired of being in this room. I feel like if I go out to get some work done, I might be more productive than me staying inside and trying to get work done from the house. Nobody else had a clue what I can do, what I can do. beautiful people i know let's let's not talk about it i have been awake since <clears throat> i have been awake since 8 a.m and right now it's 12 20 and this is when i'm speaking damn anyways i was getting some work done on my phone which i think i'm done with for the day now there's one last thing i need to do on my laptop and we can call it a day this week has been so hard and so challenging health wise my hand my hand got really tired this kind of looks cute i think i'll tie my hair like this when i show I can actually do it now get work done on the laptop and then we'll be done for the day call me brother i could have sister too That's what I said. 
I was hurt, but I accepted it, and I accepted him. Now he goes out every night and finds his own dinner. And he comes home in a great mood with a hot meal in his tummy, and all is right in the world of Jenny and Greg Throder. Should we tell her? Now. Should we tell her? <laughs> Let me tell you guys something. If it was not the month of December, like if it was not December, just, I will be watching a series right now and not stressing about anything. But here we are at 7 10 pm, still on our laptops. And I look like I don't have, like, just look at my hair, yo. I, it is well with my soul. Cocaine with the cocaine. The more money, make more rain. Good morning, beautiful people. It's actually not morning, it's like 2 pm. It's Saturday. I look really weird when this don't when this hair is down. This looks kind of better. Anyways, so you guys remember yesterday we left off where I was saying Oh, today is Saturday and I have a friend hosting and I was going to go well I was going to go but then guess who's working this girl this is a very very weird angle just someone took me on the phone outside anyway so like I can't go because I have work and I really really hate it to be honest <laughs> I don't like it at all. I had set my mind on going to the uh, launch thing, but now I can't because there's some things I need to finish today. Um, it's okay, they understand. So I just don't like it. I don't. Uh, this is a mini rant actually. I don't like it. You know, I really, really don't like it. I like staying true to my words. <laughs> if I tell them I'm gonna do something, trust and believe. I'm gonna do that thing I told you I'm gonna do. Anyways, um, I feel a little dizzy and like headed right now, but I know it's because my blood and sugar levels are a bit low. So I'm gonna eat cake. Let them eat cake right now. Um, this dress matches my skin tone. This is the dress I actually wore last night to my small brother's birthday dinner. You have seen it. I thrifted it, I think, in 2020 or 2021. Not so sure. It's a midi dress. My room is a mess. I know. It's going to get cleaned. My curls have kind of disappeared, by the way. Anyways, so instead of feeling bad and pity for myself that I'm missing out, let me go grab myself a piece of cake and come back here and finish the work I have to do. So, yeah. Last, last, now everybody go to breakfast. Shayo. 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 Morning, beautiful people. Today is Sunday. I'm going to church right now. A bit late. It's like 9:50, so it starts at 10. Um, today we actually have a youth service after the main service. We're going to be talking about mental health and all that. And that's the only one I wanted to attend actually in the afternoon. But then I have to go with my small brothers because my mom is not going today. My outfit is super beautiful. Let me show you. So I'm wearing this bodysuit. This pants, I'm gonna show you how it looks like in the mirror, and uh, this is the bag of the day, a baguette. But I have my siblings carrying their snacks in a bigger bag, so I have my Bible and my notebook in there. And then I have the black <laughs> coat is back, yeah. So this is like an old black outfit because my shoes are also black. So let me show you in the mirror, and then we can go. I look good, and I smell even better. That's how she looks like, yeah black heels and these pants i'm so obsessed with these pants and this got on top that's my outfit let's get to church Baby, you don't know. 
This is me ending this vlog. We got home at 6 p.m. and I took a nap. You know that song? What did you do? I took a nap. A really good nap. I took um in and out nap. So right now I want to shower and get into something a bit more warm because it is cold in Nairobi. So thank you so much for watching and I really really had a really good time. <laughs> I really really had a good good time at church. The youth service was A1, it was amazing. I learned so much and um yeah imagine turns out your depression is not your problem turns out your mental health problems are not your problems i mean they're not your fault and also it's genetic i i really never knew that so thank you so much for watching if you made it this far kindly comment down below glasses i can't think of anything else and i'll see you guys next time with debbie bye